Salam. And hi everybody. Today's topic is IPO analysis. IPO is an abbreviation that stands for input, process and output. A problem can be broken down into these three components in order to solve the problem correctly. Basically, input means any data that is needed to solve the problem. Process is the task that will be carried out to solve the problem. Output is the end result of the problem. IPO chart can be used to analyze a problem which consists of three components. The IPO analysis is used to analyze problems and develop algorithms. IPO analysis also used to organize and summarize the results of a problem analysis. It is also shows where in the solution the processing takes place. We can summarize the information contained in the problem statement as follows. Calculate the area of rectangle. Use the tips below. 1. What you are trying to accomplish. 2. What are the outcomes? 3. Often you work backwards from the output. 4. List the outputs, and then figure out what inputs you need in order to arrive at the outputs. Let's list it down. Output that we're looking for is area of rectangle. To get the area we need to know the width and height. For the process we can write it down combining the input and the output. The problem analysis can also be represented using IPO, input, processing, output, chart. As a summary, to get the most effective solution, we need to properly understand the problem. IPO analysis is the most effective way to figure out the most effective way in solving our problems in programming. Thank you for watching. This video is powered by Powtoon.